Hello everyone and welcome to my channel Zen Within Me. Okay, today's reading is going to be a love reading for Scorpio Sun Moon Rising. But before we get into it, I just want to thank every single one of you beautiful souls that have commented uh, to last week's video for Dana. Blessings eternally to every single one of you. It, it really, I, she was so touched, she cried. Um, it really made her weak. And it did brighten her spirits and make her feel a little bit better. You know, pain is still pain, but it did it did help. So the power of healing by all of you, thank you so much. You did really help tremendously. And many, many blessings and peace and love to every single one of you that have commented. So thank you. Okay, so this is going to be a love reading. Uh, will we be together? And when, okay, now this is, this doesn't have to be just romantic. So this could be, if you're interested in old flame, when will we get back together? When will this new soulmate come into my life? Um, if this is something to do with a job, you know, like when will we be together? When will I get that job? Okay, so this is going to be general for whatever it is that's going on in your life. It doesn't have to just be love and romance, okay? This could even be if you're on the outs with a friend or family member right now, like when will we patch things up? Okay, so any of those titles, it, it's going to fit in here. Okay, so however it resonates with you. So when will we be together? When will we patch things up? New, old, romantic or not, work or not, however it resonates with you. Okay, Scorpio, let's get into it. Guys, guardians, ancestors, angels, and ancient gods, please give me clear and concise messages for Scorpio, sun, moon, rising. Okay, so what... Is going on with Scorpio at this time when will the collective Scorpio be together with their person or situation okay will they be together with their person or situation and then we'll get to when so will Scorpio be with their person or situation Wow okay <laughs> you got some good thoughts darling let me pull these out okay all right, let me get these little easels out for you, too, so you can keep an eye on it. Also, I'm going to be doing a giveaway in October, so go and check out my community tab, okay? Um, I would normally, with the giveaways in the past, I would say, oh, subscribe and stuff like that, but then a lot of people, what they've been doing is they'll subscribe to just be involved with the giveaway, and then they unsubscribe after, and I feel that's kind of shady. So what I'm doing this time is... Uh, you make a $5 donation because this is something that you can genuinely give to, you know, show gratitude for the channel as well as genuine participation in the giveaway. And I will be giving to uh, one person, maybe two, it depends on how much uh, people participate, um, a $50 gift card of your choice, um, a $50 soulmate reading or a uh, three question love reading, which is valued at $70. Now I haven't decided if I'm gonna do all three or if I'm just gonna pick one. So go to the community tab that I have here on my channel and I actually have a poll so you can vote which one you would like. Um, if one really outshines the rest, I'll just stick with that one and then maybe do multiples depending on, but it's definitely gonna be as of right now, one prize for one person and all you have to do to participate is make a $5 donation, and I have that info down below in my description box. Okay, so exciting for October. I'm also going to be introducing my Oracle cards uh, once they are printed. Officially, I should be getting those this Friday. So a lot of exciting things going on for October. I'm going to redo the set. Okay, so let's get into your reading. What's going on with you, Scorpio? Will we be together and when? Okay. So let's see. We have here with the Eight of Wands, you have quick communication coming in. Okay, so you're definitely going to hear from someone regarding whatever it is you're dealing with. Person, situation, job, like I said before. Okay, now, King of Swords here. It's not a um, personal reading. It's a general reading, so it's not gender specific. So you may be dealing with a air sign person, a Libra, Gemini, or Aquarius. Okay, this may also be somebody that is... Um, little brash I'm getting bold very outspoken blunt but honest okay now it doesn't have to be all of those adjectives but it could just be like oh yeah this that person yeah they they're very truthful with me you know however it res resonates with you some of them they might be a little harsh but still honest nonetheless okay now I see here with the lovers now this could be a Gemini energy being that it's next to air 
makes a lot of sense. So for some of you, there's a heavy Gemini coming through here. Um, with the lovers, this can also be a choice. And this is also um, a union of love, passion, okay? So I definitely see, for those of you looking for romance, um, if this is an old flame and this is the energy or sign that you've been dealing with, they're definitely going to be coming in quick. They're going to be texting you, calling you, maybe even coming to see you. Um, but you're definitely going to get communication from this person, whether it's romantically or not. Okay. Uh, so definitely, will we be together? This is a big fat yes. And as opposed to when, I'll pull some moonology cards and we'll see when. Okay. All right. So let's pull some analogy cards now and let's see when. So yes, big fat yes, you're going to hear from this person. And if this is new love, yes, you're going to have new love coming in. And I would say soon, okay? Okay, we are also, this is a timeless reading, so you have to pay attention to when you see this as well. We're also in the time of Libra right now. It's Libra season. So we have this air energy here, which is, like I said, Libra, Gemini, Aquarius. So this could be... With this also being quick, soon, um, I feel this is going to be happening like within the next 30 days, the, with, within the time of Libra season, okay? So let's see, what other messages do we have? When will this happen? When will you be together with your person or your situation? Can you, can you please give us a when for Scorpio? Okay, thank you. Okay, so hold your vision, fixed moon. So don't give up yet. If some of you are feeling like, ah, this isn't going to happen, if this is like with an old flame, where you're waiting to hear something career-wise and you haven't heard anything yet, just hold on. Don't be so quick to give up, okay? For some of you, your commitment is being tested here, first quarter moon, okay? And then we have a time for healing, balsamic moon. All right, so some of you may need to heal or uh, there may be a healing period here that is necessary before you get this communication. Okay, let's get some initials and letters here. Who is Scorpio dealing with? This way, if it's somebody old or new, whatever the situation is, let's see if we can get you some letters and initials, person, place, or thing. And these are the cards that I've created and I'm going to have printed. So excited. I can't wait to show you guys. They will be available for sale. So uh, just make sure you subscribe and click the bell. So when I put that showcase video up, you will be notified. Okay, so let's see what letters and initials do we have for Scorpio? Okay, so we have an X here. So yes, for some of you you're dealing with an X and we have O. So there's gonna be a lot of hugs and kisses going on here. I'm also getting, for some of you, you may have, like, if you guys were bored, especially with COVID, you may have been playing, like, tic-tac-toe. Okay, uh, I'm getting a very strong New York here. Um, we have the letter, again, Oregon. Okay, that's coming through. Oregon, but then also, um, let me show you this while I'm saying New York. We have York. It could also be York, because this is a worldwide um, channel. And um, I mean, Yorktown, York, I think that's in England someplace. I don't know every single city in the world, so please bear with me. But I'm getting um, New York. New York is also coming through. Um, can also be a street. I'm also seeing Roy. Roy is spelled out. Okay, so any of those letters, person, place, or thing. Also Rory. I'm seeing Rory, however, that works for you and Corey Corey's also coming through okay also somebody like Bjork I got Bjork coming through okay so rye somebody eats rye bread Kentucky Ryan okay let's see if we can get some traits now, this is also included in my Oracle deck, so it's uh, the initials and the traits. It's an initial and trait Oracle deck. Okay, what other traits are there of Scorpio's person that they are dealing with? Okay, thank you so much. So your person may have piercings. They are funny. 
short and something about their voice okay I have the nanny coming through somebody might be a fan of the nanny also or like to mock because they're funny they may like to make fun of the nanny voice or they may have a funny voice okay okay let's see if we can get some more messages here okay so I'm going to my artist deck my music deck to see what genre of music your person likes what other messages come through uh, maybe they resemble the artist Let's see, what other messages do we have for Scorpio? All right, thank you. All right, so we have here, Folk and Country, Paul Simon, number five. So also pay attention to the numbers. So that could be like um, October 5th, five days may be relevant as far as their birthday goes. Paul Simon, there's two more names coming through. Okay. They may have short hair like that, short brown hair, okay. Um, Blue Soul R&B, Amy Winehouse, number five again, same thing. I'm hearing Johnny Five, somebody may be a fan of like Short Circuit, that movie from the 80s, if you guys remember that. Okay, number 10, Pop Music, Madonna. I'm hearing Lucky Star. Folk and Country, Dolly Parton, the letter Q. And rock and roll, Chuck Berry, number seven. Okay, so those are your messages for this week, Scorpio. Thank you guys again for being so kind to Dana. Really appreciate it. Much love sent your way. Many blessings sent your way to those of you that took the moment to, to show such love and kindness. I really do appreciate it. I can't thank you guys enough. Um, make sure you go to that community tab. Check out my affiliates down below. Um, if... I highly recommend checking out Magic Planet if you want to buy crystals, candles, like cards, like anything. Just go check it out. They have it all. Fantastic website. And it's all decently priced. And you use my code Zen with them and you get a discount too. So make sure you um, check that out down below. Also, um, if you want to get your chart done, go to Truly Divine. And then also if you're interested in purchasing the Island Time Wellness Cards, that's uh, these little cards that I use sometimes in my readings. You can go and get that there as well. Okay, so peace and love, and I will see you guys in the next reading.